set of just the whole defensive unit, the, the review on on the uh, on the onside kick gets overturned. You guys got to go out there after celebrating that that you're gonna get the ball back and, and, you, and you hold them down. How uh, just, just kind of walk us through your guys' mindset through through that. Position. Uh, yeah, we just know as deep as a unit, uh, regardless of, regardless of how that call went, uh, you know, we still have to go back out there and uh, you know, just control what we can control. We can't control whatever the call is, but uh, we can't control our effort and how we respond to that call. So, defense go out there with our head held high and uh, continue to fight. So. How tough? When you're playing a team like the Oklahoma, how, how tough is it to be be a corner playing an offense that? That the quarterback that time. Oh, you know, they got a lot of talented guys. Um, the quarterback as well, very talented. So uh, you definitely have to be on your on your P's and Q's every every snap. Uh, don't take don't take any snap for granted. So uh, just making sure that you're being very disciplined. That's one thing we're big on this week in our preparation preparation and um, just making sure and, uh, you're doing your job at the end of the day. Do your job and trust the guy next to you to do his job. What can you attribute some of the tackling issues to that you guys have had the last two football games? Uh, you know, we just got to be better. We got to be better. We all got to look in the mirror and see what we can do to get better as a team individually. And, uh, you know, just continue to keep working hard and uh, we'll, we'll get better. Do you feel like you're, you're aggressive since the first three games or do you feel like you're close to how you guys, you know, how well the defense played the first three games? Do you, you said, like, I'm sorry, do you say that again? Do you feel like you're close to how well you guys were playing in that first three games as a defense? Do you feel like you're that far off? Oh, for sure. I'm, I'm proud of my guys. Uh, one thing I can say, we continue to uh, just have effort, effort and uh, giving our all. And that's one thing I've seen. Even when we get down, our guys continue to keep fighting. Uh, last last week, you know, we were down early. Second half, we came out, we fought hard, and uh, things that go our way with even today. Uh, to continue to uh, progress throughout the day and just work and uh, get, get great effort. Apologize about that. That's you. <laughs> Apologize. But uh, yeah, um, you know, like I said, just uh, continue to just keep working and control what we can control. And uh, that's one thing is our effort. So. How would you characterize the team's morale at this point after the first two losses of the season? Um, I would say uh, even though we didn't get the victory, uh, we're just going to continue to hold our head high. No, I believe, believe strongly that we have a good football team, great football team. We have potential of being great. So um, just continue to just build on and uh, continue to just progress every week and, uh, you know, eventually things will get rolling and we'll move in the direction that we want to move. With the bye coming, do you feel like you guys wish you could go out there and play next week or do you feel like it's kind of coming at the right time for you guys? Oh, definitely. Uh, just after this game, uh, coming to the locker room, seeing guys, the emotion, uh, it's real. Um, you know, just got to take it to the chin. But uh, definitely we all wish we had another opportunity or a couple calls may go some ways and, uh, you know, never know the outcome of that game. but. Now, at this point, uh, just move forward and uh, get ready for the next game.